Hey, welcome to Graphic Pals Telvin GP TV. I'm Brad. It's a new month. We've got a new loot anime in my hands. Now, loot anime is one of the numerous geeky boxes out there that delivers a bunch of goods to your doorstep. You don't necessarily know what you're going to get. Except this one, you know, helps you a little bit. It's got anime in there. So it's got tons of stuff from anime and manga. For those type of fans, it seems to be a great box. Now, this is from Crunchyroll and Loot Crate. Loot Crate does tons of different boxes. There's loot anime. There is... Uh, some specialty boxes, uh, they just did a Minecraft one, there's Loot Crate, the main box, Loot Crate DX, which is an expanded one. There's a whole bunch, Loot Wear for clothing, go check it out. Loot Anime, they do hook us up, so this is a free box that they give us for review, so thank you so much Loot Anime and Crunchyroll for the hookup. Um, we're going to open up, we're going to show off what's inside, now I've said with every video, you know, I don't know a ton about anime and manga, I'm learning more and more and more as the months go on, which makes me uh, nice and happy. Uh, it's actually been pretty cool so far. There's been, you know, some manga things in there that I do recognize, and I find it, like, really interesting uh, to see what is in store. Now, with this box, with Loot Crate, they normally do, like, a, a booklet that kind of has uh, tons of information that shows off what's inside. Instead, for Loot Anime, it's a bit different. They give you a poster. Which is actually pretty cool. Um, this one, I have no idea what it's for. It's illustrated by Finney uh, Chang. But, you know, I think posters are always a fun thing. It's just a nice, uh, different thing that puts out there. So, let's go through and show off what's inside. They've got this nice handy guide for people like me who don't know uh, everything that's in the box. So first up, we've got from Cowboy Bebop. This is something that I, I actually know. Uh, we've got Ein Plush, little plush figure of a nice little dog. So, the galaxy is a pretty big place and lawlessness can run rampant in Cowboy Bebop. The government solves this problem by registering bounty hunters, also known as cowboys, to help bring in criminals. An important part of a crew of the bounty hunters in the spaceship Bebop, uh, Ein is a genetically engineered Pembroke Welsh Corgi with human-like intelligence. He's also super cute. We know we need to be able to, uh, able to squeeze him in real life. Take this plush with you on any space adventure. Now, I know Cowboy Bebop. Couldn't tell you how the hell to pronounce the name, so if I'm uh, mispronouncing it, feel free to make fun of me. Uh, this is from Quantum Mechanics, licensed by Sunrise. It's actually pretty cute. Uh, the other thing that kind of stands out to me is uh, Corgis are really in right now. Uh, if you've been reading Mockingbird from Marvel, you'll know that Corgis was this really popular thing uh, within the comic series. I have no idea why. I'm not a dog person. But overall, you know, it's a cute little plush Corgi. Gotta like it, right? Um, so this one's actually awesome. We're not actually going to skip that. We're going to come to that one last because that makes me really, really happy. Uh, so we've got a Space Patrol Loco keychain. I do not know this one. So it comes in this nice little bag, little velvet bag. We're going to open it up and show it off. Uh, so this is from the makers of Kill La Kill Studio Trigger. Space Patrol uh, Loco is an anime about space and love and responsibility. And I don't think I can open it. Uh, yeah, I can open this up. Despite living in outer space, 13-year-old Luloko has a pretty normal childhood. That is until her space patrol father is frozen, and she is forced to replace him as a space patrol agent. Despite the new craziness in her life, uh, there are some perks, such as meeting the mysterious transfer student and space patrol agent uh, Alpha Omega Nova. Luloko's crush is represented uh, by an... A flutter jewel, the manifestation of a normal girl's first love. We knew this was pure and beautiful jewel. We make the perfect keychain. So there we go. As I said, I know absolutely nothing about this. So if you're into this, uh, if you know Space Patrol, sound off in the comments and let me know uh, should I check it out or not. I kind of rely on you, the viewers and commenters, to, to really know what's worth me diving into and what's not. So please do. All right, next we've got something from Sailor Moon. I know Sailor Moon. I remember Sailor Moon growing up. We've got a Sailor Moon bottle opener. Sailor Moon is an incredibly popular uh, shoujo franchise about Usagi, a middle schooler who has a destiny to save Earth from the forces of evil. She transforms into Sailor Moon, and with the help of other guardians named after the planets in the solar system, she battles the Dark Kingdom. Now she helps you in the battle against evil forces of thirst with this Kawaii bottle opener. It's licensed by Toy Animation, made by Just Funky. It is a Loot Crate exclusive. 
Uh, you know, I, I know uh, Sailor Moon is something that I remember watching when I was a kid. You know, it's really, really popular. There's all kinds of new iterations of it that are uh, going over really well. Bottle openers are always a good thing. I can always use a new one, and one that I'm not going to lose like this is a good thing. All right, so we're going to go with the charm. Now, normally in a lot of the Loot Crate boxes, they do uh, pins for you to show off uh, and uh, show off your collection. In the Loot Crate anime or Loot anime, they do charms instead, like the charms that you would find and put on your phones or whatever. So this is a Yumi Galaxy Charm. Yumi is the ready to explore the galaxy in this month's charm, wearing her adorable and airtight spacesuit. Her heroine celebrates the spirit of discovery and friendship in anime and manga art by Finney Chang, who also did the poster. Now this one is what I'm saving for last. Robotech is something I grew up on. I've got the entire animated series sitting over in my DVD collection. I am a Robotech fan, so this is pretty awesome. This is a Loot Crate exclusive, Loot Anime exclusive, Robotech LED lamp. So Robotech, the legendary mecha series that helped to make anime popular in the U.S. has it all. Transforming robots, giant alien spaceships, multi-generational galactic war and compelling love triangle. The Macross saga introduced viewers to the world of Robotech, which was actually three shows combined for U.S. syndication, with the story of an abandoned space battleship reconstructed by humanity to tackle an alien invasion. This futuristic lamp modeled from a robot in Robotech, the Macross saga, may not protect against aliens, but will at least protect against the darkness. So this is licensed by Harmony Gold, made by Bernusen, Deutsch, and Associates. So we're going to open it up and hopefully this works. I have no idea what the hell to expect. Uh, I don't know if it's actually going to, because I probably need to power it up, which, you know, is part of the issues with doing things little, like videos like this. You can't go back and show things off as easily. So we got this. This is going to light up in, uh, I don't know, Robotech goodness. I, I don't know how to describe it. So you can see it, the nice base of Robotech. Um, you know, it's it's kind of cool. It's it's something different. It's something new. I can't say I've ever seen this in a box like that before uh, in any of these boxes. So um, overall, I'm fairly impressed with it. It's, it's it is unique. And if you're a Robotech fan, I'd imagine you're pretty psyched about this. Um, does come with a nice USB card or cord to. Uh, Powered up, I guess, and some handy user instructions. So, thank you for the interest in the Robotech LED lights. Be careful, read the user instructions, and there is a bunch of user instructions. Overall, a very interesting box. Now, the last few boxes that they've had has had anime, which I've really, really dug. Um, I, or sorry, not anime, manga which I've really, really dug because these are things that I've never read before and the ability to read manga of things that I have never read is pretty neat and like I like it a lot. Um, you know, there's not here, but instead we get the Robotech LED light-up thing, which is pretty neat uh, and definitely something to check out. But overall, not bad. Like I, I still have to say, if you are an anime fan, I think you probably should check out uh, loot anime. It's uh, it's always an interesting box. If you are interested in getting your own loot anime and starting off the new year right, you can go and sign up with the link below this video. It's an L uh, affiliate link, so we do get a small percentage from you doing that. But by doing that, you help support our site. Thank you so much for doing that. But by watching these videos, you help support our site, and thank you for that. Uh, you know, as we wrap up the new year. Thank you so much for helping uh, Graphic Policy supporting us. You can check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. Of course, we're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. So until next year, thank you for watching. Keep reading the manga, keep watching the anime, and more importantly, keep it geeky.